Hello and welcome back to the vault. Happy to have you guys here. Just getting started on the day. Uh, we're going to be back to getting or getting back to some more uh, Dark Souls 2020. Welcome. Happy to have you here. How are you today? How are you? There's that cutie. Oh, hi. Hello. There's my Maggie. Allie. Bringing in them bobs. <laughs> them cat bobs. <laughs> I got a I got a laugh out of that. Thank you. Thank you. Daily Saucer, hello. No regerts, no regrets. Cat plus blob bob equals money. It's the way to go. It's the way to go. No regrets. We just got to work on your execution. That's fine. We'll, we'll get you there. We'll get you there. Maybe I should post a picture of Maggie's execution. So that way other people have like, they have, they have the, the guidance on what they have to do. <laughs> no, no Rickettoni. What we had, we had, um, we had, what is that? Chick, chickpea? I think it's like chickpea, uh, the other night. Ansika, hello. I mean, we like rigatoni, yeah. I mean, I, you know, it, it is chickpea. Okay, yeah, it's pretty good. It's honestly, it's pretty that that bonsai stuff or what? I think it's bonsai, right? I think it's pretty good for a gluten-free pasta, and it's like all like just ground chickpea turned into a pasta. It's pretty delicious. I I don't know. I like it. I think it goes well with the sauce. I don't, maybe I'm crazy. I don't know. I, I like. I enjoy it. I get something out of it. But um yeah, hopefully we're going to have a great day uh to start um the 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 craziness of the ethernet is going back to hot tub streams. I like this is where we're falling back to. We're we're degrading ourselves back to hot tub streams now. Um Oh, Shep, bro, I gotta, I gotta send this link to you. I gotta send this link to Maggie. She's gonna flip. She'll flip. Where's my, where's my girl? Where's my girl? Where's Maggie? Oh, I can't post Maggie because that's not what her name's listed as. Here we go. Um, This just popped up on my news panel, and I think you would like it, Maggie. I think I'm pretty sure you would like that. Um, just because of, you know, obviously the conversations that we had had previously. But that's that's really cool. Um, all right, so let's see here. What's my news panel say? Ninja is a playable character in Raid Shadow Legends now? Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Like, the ninja, the streaming ninja is now a playable character in Raid Shadow Legends, the game that we always hear ads for and everything for. Uh, I did. I texted you via Discord. I apologize. Um, Ansika, how are you today? How are you doing? Can he just not? Does does anyone... Let me... Let me I'm going to ask a hard question. Does anyone think... that Ninja has influenced the streaming space in a positive fashion. I'm doing very well, Ansika. I had a wonderful date with my girlfriend today before um, before coming down here to stream. And um, it was it was amazing. I got to spend some time and just tell her how cute she was. And we had a nice little burger. And then we came home and cuddled the cats. And then um, she started twerking on the couch for like three seconds before we took the dog out. It was a good day. It's it's good day so far. It's a good day. Mama said, if you don't have anything nice to say, don't say it. Your mom said that? <laughs> Your mom. Your mom? That's exactly what me and my boyfriend did, too. Listen, not my mom. <laughs> TTV short blocker. Hello. I, I have a feeling 
I have a feeling that your mom would be like, well, that's dumb. Who would say that? How's anyone ever gonna do anything right if no one tells them they're doing it wrong in the first place? That's dumb. <laughs> I'm, so, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm not far off. Everyone's like, wow, Ham's being really rude. I'm actually, I'm pretty close. That that impersonation's, it's, it's close. I know we've kind of gone over it a little bit before, but, and I thought my mom was crazy. Allie, we were actually, Maggie and I were just talking about that the other day. We really were. Um, TTV Short Blocker, I'm doing pretty well. Hopefully you're doing the exact same thing. My mom always said that you should say what your opinion is, even if it's rude. I think the person should be able to have an open mind, um, which, uh, by the way, uh, Nossian, uh, I, I hope that I wonder if that comes across in closed caption correctly. It probably doesn't. It's probably nowhere close to the right name. Um, Nas, I guess that's about as close that I might be able to pull that it'll still get the correct, at least moderately close. Um, oh, Shep. Oh, OK, I barely made that on there. Um, hopefully, hopefully you're having a great day. Um, but I, I feel like, I feel like there's some things that you should definitely be more upfront and forward about, you know, with your opinions, but there's definitely tact is a large part of that. Oh my gosh. I have the itchies. Oh, it's like, it's up my nose. Oh, I'm going to die. Oh yeah. Two degree. Yeah. I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure. Oh. All right, I don't know where to go. Too many psh, get out of here. Says says the girl who literally was like, "Listen, if Ellie doesn't cuddle me tonight, we're taking her back." If you want to solve a problem quickly, say the wrong answer and everyone will tell you what you did wrong and give the answer. What if they just ask you what your opinion is? Like, "Well, how did you get to that answer?" I would love to know. I feel like that's like a roundabout way of saying that you're wrong still. You know what I mean? Like people are still suggestive of what's actually happening. Bro, this is not, this is hitting different. Nas or, uh, those, those I would feel like sound the same to me. Naz or Nas? Naz or Nas. I'm just gonna go with that. Naz or Nas. So, they sound the same to me though. Um But again, just to me. Ooh! Okay. Okay, come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. Can I backstab these? Does anyone know if I can backstab these? These gargoyle-like things? Uh, and one doggo. Uh, yeah, we have, we have three cats and then the one doggo. We just got our third cat. Um, just got our third cat. So wait, Ansika, did you did you guys did you uh you you said you and your boyfriend, right? Did you guys go out um today for for hamburgers? Like literally like the exact same thing? Cause I'm I'm gonna be like, yo, what are the odds? Hamburger day, hamburger day. Ham, hamburger, hamburger day. Except mine wasn't real meat. Oh yeah, you got like the one of those impossible burgers. We, we've eaten chicken, but we went out and afterward we cuddled with the cats. Oh, wait, how many cats do you guys have? Are they shared cats? Or is it like, you know, one person brought the cats into the relationship? They're inherited cats. Inherited cats are honestly sometimes a really, they're like a blessing in disguise. We have two, they are mine. Otherwise, the closest you'll get with the captions is nausea rather than my name. Though I don't mind responding when I see nausea on the screen. <laughs> I mean, and you're 
you probably have run into a circumstance where someone's describing like that they deal with nausea over maybe like height, you know, like they have vertigo or something like that. Maybe, you know, if you're not 100% paying attention, I guess that could be difficult. Cause you'd, you'd really have to be like paying attention. I don't know. And I don't know how, I, obviously like, I don't, I don't go, I, I don't go through the situation of having like the watch and everything. So like, I don't know how that works. Um, hey man, hope the game is going well. It is going very, very well, Smeep. Great to have you back. How are you today? We're, uh, we're literally, we're just getting started. Um, Zvihanda. Okay, so I can Chaos Blade reinforce, which I really need to do. Demon Titanite. Can I purchase that? I cannot purchase that. That is fine. I got one upgrade from that. I'm gonna lurk and go make some food. Not a problem. I live, I live with being deaf and using live transcribe, and it's like learning another language. But you kind of get over it a time over time. Um, I, I mean, like. I, I think that that's, you know, part of the education process in general. Like, you know, you, 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 can, you can pick up any language. You can... You, you, you can pick up, like, anything over time, especially as long as you have the desire and the will to do it. I think a lot of people kind of overlook the potential of the human mind to conquer tasks, to conquer challenges and uh, obstacles in life. Uh, he has Malinoy. What, what? What's? What is that again? I'm good just farming on Legends of I Eidolon and training. I teach Kung Fu, um, and that has started back up. So I'm buzzing from the class. Wow, Maggie, haven't you been watching a lot of TV where they use that word buzzing? It's like a state of enjoyment, bliss, and happiness. I'm pretty sure I feel like that's something that we've been hearing a lot. Buzzing. I think a lot of people lack the motivation. I think a lot of people lack the motivation for a lot of things, Antoine. I mean, look at your recent endeavor, if, if you don't mind me, like, kind of pointing the spotlight on you for a second. But you, you've taken to doing a boot camp for coding simply because you found that you have a passion within an area and you're excited about it. And, like, it was hard. You voiced that it was very challenging, very hard. But with the correct will and the motivation you made it happen so like done and done oh my gosh how do i get over there how do i get over there like are you are you you're you've got to be shitting on me Oh, oh, okay. So it's a type of dog. I apologize. Thank you. Um, you can make the chaos blade with the merchant you were talking to. I have it. I have it. No, no, no. So, oh, uh, hey, RWM. Hello. Welcome back. So I actually, I picked it up. Um, I, I, I just got that like right before the end of the stream. Um, and I've just, uh, uh, Im imbued it, reinforced it to level plus one. Um, and people were telling me everything about what's required behind the Chaos Blade and how you can have up to 10 stacks of humanity. And there's kind of like a soft cap for like a total of, you know, 200 some odd plus damage that you can get out of it. Um, and that, you know, even if you're at 40 decks or whatever, I mean, uh, the difference between 40 decks with max damage and then, you know, uh, 50 decks max damage is only like 50 total damage, which isn't that much. So I just finished the Chaos Blade. Um, I leveled it up a little bit early, I guess. Someone said that I was supposed to wait just a second, and I kind of screwed that up. I just hit the button and called it a day, and, um, it wasn't Smeep. I think it was Stratos? It might have been Stratos or someone else. I don't remember who it was in specific, but they had suggested that I made a mistake initially in immediately transitioning it over to the Chaos Blade and reinforcing it into that version. Version. Sorry, version. Um, fun to watch games. Hello, how are you? Heavy attack with the Chaos Blade is sexy AF. Well, that's good news. Plus, with the extra argue or sorry, augments I have, 
Um, that helps, especially when going to the lab to get blood tested. Everyone there is Indian and Polynesian. Oh, and you were talking about that with your job and then learning that and understanding that I still get by. It makes me a little sad that make makes me a little sad that some think because captions are horrible, they won't use it. Well, and I, I hope over the next couple of years, there'll be some sort of developmental structure to where we can see an increase in the quality, the efficiency, and the accuracy of translation in live time to help people in need get a way that they can still involve themselves and 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 be be presented, be represented. Sorry. I think the technology is only going to get better. And I would agree with that. I mean, like Google's come a long way with a lot of different um, uh, ease of access features. So Latin, uh, Farsi, uh, Swahili, um, Greek. Sorry, I'm, I'm just throwing some names out there at this point. Does anyone know how I get this? Do I drop down onto this? I hope I hope this is it. Because if not, I'm going to be sorely vexed. I guess that's it. I did it. How do I get down now? Am I stuck here forever? Oh, no. There's like a little ledge here. Okay. Oh, my gosh. I'm a hacker. Oh, oh! Uh, is is that Salagi? That one's new. What um? What what country? What country recognizes that in prominence? Is that Cherokee? Uh, yeah, I've just never heard of it, and I apologize for the ignorance. I just genuinely don't know. See? Cherokee. Oh, so it's... Che okay, okay. Well, I apologize for the misunderstanding. I've never... I've never heard it called that. That's new. At least to me, that's... That's a... That's a... That's a new lesson. Yeah, that's that's also a vastly dying language, unfortunately. I find it kind of weird that we really kind of used it a, a whole culture in order to gain an advantage in war. I know that that's like a it's an interesting topic. Uh, I'm from the UK. Just run and it'll be fine. Uh, only like 200 speakers or something like that. That's wow. 200? 200. <laughs> you want to talk about small town vibes. The gravity of that situation is... That's shocking. Wow. I I think I think someone said Legends of Eidolon. I think that's what Oh, bro, are you seriously? You're just going to like the whole time. Can you come? Can you come here? I'm behind them.
There we go. There we go. So I was told backstab doesn't take any damage when you get the sword attack off. Uh, yeah, that's the one. It's so bad. There are places that will pay you and give you housing just to learn the language. Wasn't Cherokee like the biggest Native American tribe? Uh, excuse me if I'm being ignorant. No, I mean, like, listen, I, I'm of the mind that it's okay to ask questions as long as you're not doing it in a fashion that's obviously or distinctly trying to be like, hey, listen, I'm only asking because, like, uh, you know, I'm, I'm trying to create a rift. Yeah, that would be bad. But I don't think that anyone's doing that here. I think everyone's got a respectful tone. I think we genuinely, you know, like, we, people want to know. They're interested. And they're eager to discover and learn more. Learning is never an issue. And we should, as a culture, as society, yeah, I found language fasc fascinating as well. I mean, Antoine, you probably know with all the times that I've tried to mimic, um, mimic uh, accents and articulation and things like that. It's, it's always, it's very interesting to me. I'm not great at it, but it's interesting. Sure has quite a bit of tribes. Yeah, I don't, I can't remember. I remember there was like a, um, I don't remember the number, but I remember someone had quoted to me once how many unique tribes there were um, within the Native, Native American, um, Native American culture and community. And I don't remember what that number was, but I remember it being a lot higher than you would think. A lot higher. I just It was just unexpected, you know? It'd be like someone telling you, like, how many different ways there are to make sandwiches, and you've only really ever made three. You're like ham and cheese, turkey and cheese, chicken? <laughs> oh, come on. I'm not sure, but Cherokee. Oh yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. We are. We we got that one. Mm. So wait, does anyone know what I'm supposed to do here? Like, do where do I where do I continue on? I'm a direct descendant of Sequoia. That I I I don't know how to read that. If I'm being honest, I don't know how to read that. It looks like Vito, but, you know, if I say something bad, it's because I never read my text two times and I'm on the phone. Wait, what? If you want to get a demon Titanite to upgrade your weapon, you can kill these demons and kill those demons in Sense Fortress. The de You mean like those snake-like creatures? Is that what you mean? You need to kill the boss next. It is... Sound for sound, the same as the Romanized name before? Oh. Oh, okay, okay, okay. So Sequoia, as it were. And the the thing that looks like the four with the V-T-O-H. Okay. As, okay, gotcha, gotcha. No, you drop down when you enter and there's three demons? I don't think I ever is you have to do you have to fall or something? And that is really cool. Thank you for the lesson. I appreciate that. So do you have to fall the moment you enter Sen's Fortress? Because I don't even remember that. Just jump down. Alright, well maybe we'll make wait, can I get back from here? Do I just go back up to where we landed and then go back? There's actually four? Oh. And I can get the Titanite and then. Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me catch up in a second. Oh! Oh! I'm dodging. I'm yeeting. I'm deleting.
There is one in on Orlando as well. How many do I need? I have, I believe I have zero right now and I'm trying to get uh, upgrades for my chaos sword chaos blade. Um, I would love to get more damage so I can get back to the same damage that I was from my Kuchi Katana. Um, was a Native American polymath of the Cherokee Nation. In 1821, he completed his independent creation of the Cherokee Silberry, making reading and writing in Cherokee possible. Nice. Nice. So there is at least a catalog. Um... There's a catalog of the of the language and the dialect, so at least people can go back to it. I mean, because that's that's helpful. At least it lives on no matter what. Have you beat the boss of this area? Uh, likely not. Man, I feel like I'm always right on the point where I should be for a backstab and it's just not the right spot. But that's fine. It's it's fine. It's fine. We got it. We got it. So I'm going to go back down. I don't want to go back down this way. We know that the shortcut's the opposite side. And we do have the path down to this bonfire, but it's not necessary you must open the big door now, and there's two big dudes. Now, if you want to light Zaban fire in Firelink Shrine, you must fight Lartek before the boss fight. But for that fight, you must use black orb you have in your inventory. Wait, what? The black orb? What does it what does it do? I do the boss. After that, you get an ability that will make backtracking way easier. So I have to fight a small boss like down here. Is it? It's not those guys. You said I have to kill the two big guys. Can I open the door and not kill these guys? Or do I have to open the door or do I have to kill them in order to be able to open the door? Oh, is that is that a handle over there? That looks like a handle that would open the door. Oh, he's coming. You don't have to kill them. Okay. So I feel like I definitely want to open this door first to make sure that it's done and done. I don't have to think about it. I don't have to deal with it. I know that I can I can knock it out and make it work. Ow. Rude. Very rude. Okay, okay, okay. Wait, are, are they healing? They can heal. So rude. Did I just roll right into it? Because the game, like... Okay, so I'm going to have to back off a little bit. And then do this. And then come back into this fight. Got him. Your boy got him. Woo. You can just run over Operation Streaming Fist. Hello, welcome. Uh uh hold on. Let me let me catch up here. Uh I wouldn't go back. Do you have something called the black or eye orb? Yes, yeah, yeah. So um it, it's I think it's the same icon that's like up there, but when I got down into uh on Orlando like here in the cathedral, it said like when I went to kill that like weird, you know, uh, Pike Archer guy on the stairwell. It said like e the black orb starts vibrating or something like that. So I think that's that's what it was. And then um, you can run over small easy boss fight. I know it can be hard, but learning to parry might be great fun. Well, I, I was doing okay with it, um, but I, I feel like I still could use a little bit of experience. I, I actually probably could use a lot of experience um, in parry slash block slash repost. Um, 
I I R C. The only things. What what is I I R C? What is the acronym? What does that stand for? The only things you can actually have to kill in this game are the bosses. If you don't want to accidentally roll towards him, just unlock. If I recall, okay, that makes sense. If I recall correctly, okay. Yeah, that's it. You need to use it here. Want to kill a traitor? Use the orb. My nest partner's cat doesn't like me, but funny enough, I'm the one willing to give the cat attention. Yet my nest partner pushes the cat away, but he keeps going back to them. <laughs> cats are cats are crazy sometimes. Like, let's just be honest. Cats have their own mind, their own agenda, their own existence, and they'll fight for it. They'll die for it. They're wild. We were we were talking a little bit about how much of an opportunist they are. Um, cats, that is. Um, I'm I'm both. I'm an animal person. Originally, I actually um, before I went into the video game space, uh, I originally wanted to be a veterinarian. Oh, I have to deal with an archer at the same time as this? Nah. You're on your own. Oh, I screwed that up. I screwed that up big. What was that? What was the... What was that heavy attack that did nothing? Wow, rude. I like went to pop a heavy attack and nothing happened. What is that? That is the worst heavy attack in the world. No one should do that ever in combat. That leaves you really, really open. This is worse than, like, a Las Vegas relationship. Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh! Come on. Ow. Ow. Yeah, yeah, turn. Rude. I was out of there. I was so out of there. Got it! Woo! Uh, yeah, so I've got the Chaos Blade, the, the Kuchi Katana upgraded to the, the Chaos Blade. Yes, very much. Uh, don't use the orb, you don't have to kill them. Uh, I don't know how much, I don't know much about this game, but end up sending a few people stream it, uh, end up seeing a few people stream it, is there a lore to this? I have no idea. You're asking the wrong person. Um, is there... So, hold on. I know that there's a lot of lore to the game, but I don't know what the lore is to this particular moment. Second off, Sea Fuels, welcome. Happy to have you back here in the, the vault. Now, this orb that I have, you guys are saying, use it, don't use it. Where am I supposed to use this? At what point does this, like, come in to play? I don't even see it in my inventory. Is it a key? It's not a key. What the hell orb? Is it the black eye orb? Is that it? The black eye orb. What? So what is it? It's next to the Estus. Okay. So do I equip that or do I just use that? And then you're suggesting just you use it now. Immediately where I am right now. 
that what you're that's what you're saying equip it and then use it well i don't have to equip it right can't i just use it like i wouldn't need to equip it if i can just use it right for my inventory okay try invading world of the fire keepers killer so we're gonna hit yes and then i'm gonna go into whatever world i'm going into is that that's right good good luck Why do you guys always do this to me? Yeah, yeah, so do this thing. Do this thing, just trust us. Do this thing, right? Right? Oh, good luck. <laughs> good luck. <laughs> You're going to get wrecked. <laughs> You're going to die. <laughs> Every time. Every time. You have a bit less Estus when invading. I did not know that. That's the first time I've known that. You need to do it. Take it easy. Bait them one at a time. Okay, this looks like a caster, some sort of cleric person, cleric-like cleric person. Yo, Joe. Yo, Joe. Yo, Joe. Yo, Joe. G.I. Joe. How do I... Hello? Will one of you please attack me? Just one, preferably? Preferably? Hello? Shield means nothing against Lorik. Wow. Well, I mean, maybe shield means something against these small dudes. Small people. I can't tell what the person on the left is. Hello? Oh, Shep. Shep! Nope! I'm out! I'm out! I'm out! It's all three. You guys said do do one at a time. Bait them one at a That is not a strategy that is working effectively right now at this current junction. Oh, can I can I cheese this? Hello? 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 Dear Cheese, are you available to cook? What? That is just cruel. That is so cruel. How can a person... How can a person parry on a fall? <laughs> Look, I have exactly 13,500 souls. How fantastic. You can do it again, and I suggest killing him so you can have the bonfire lit again. You'll need it. Range battle are a bitch to fight. Guess who I kill first? Uh, I would assume the caster. And then probably the pikeman, and then probably Aloratech, which actually is a company that makes products. Um, okay, so if I kill the person who's not glowing, 
then the fight automatically ends. But do I get, like, the souls of the other two automatically? Or are they just not souls? You're not going to be able to aggro one. It's going to have to be all three. But take your time. Oh, man, come on. Can't I just, like... Can't I just, like, push a button and win? Isn't there, like, a button up against the wall that, like, I can, like... You know, like, if I, if I go down here, right? And I farm up, like, a ton of kills... Like, before I go in, can I just, like, call in the nuke? And then that's it? Like, you just, you call in the nuke and you win, the game's over? Like, I just respawn and... Give it the old Antoine 1-2? Like, yo, bro, I'm on a 35 kill streak. Lol. What are you gonna do about it? You don't have to bother with the other two. Yeah, that's right. If you kill the host, which is Lawtrek, any of the summons get ejected. This works in multiplayer too. There's a lever that can make you instantly win, but it's at my place in the hot tub and you must have your shirt off. I mean, what up, dwellers? <laughs> Easy button win. Yeah, why hasn't anyone thought of that? Just a casual 35 piece. Just a little 35 dinner. A little 35 piece dinner. It's fine. How is that not a backstab? Like, really? Really? Let's let's be honest here. Standing behind the, the person who's literally standing still. That's the greatest way to die. I feel like that's how Maggie falls onto the couch every day. Hello? Just go to the elevator and the door is open. The elevator and the door is open. Wait, what? Come on. I'm behind I'm behind him. I'm behind him. I'm behind him. I'm almost enough to be able to, like, level up one more thing. I'm trying to level up another point. Um, yeah, you just opened it, and backstabs are real easy in DS1. Wonder what the problem is. I feel like I'm lining those up, right? You were either angled wrong way, r angled wrong or too far away. You gotta romance it. So, let me, let me get this straight. Operation Streaming Fist. What you're saying is, is that the length of my sword is not adequate enough? <laughs> if you're struggling with backstabs, try pushing towards the enemy while you're doing it. And make sure you're not holding the shield up. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Switch, thank you so much for the host. Unfortunately, no matter how long your sword is, you need to be in the grappling range to mount them. Inside of grappling range to mount them? That sounds like a lot. Try and do the splits on me. Get on your knees. Hello? 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 All right, we're going to go to the other side. Inside the grappling range to mount them. Sounds like a fun time. Absolutely, man. I hope the stream is going... Ah! It's going well. Thank you. Thank you, Switch. Wait, when's the tourney start? When's that... When's that whole thing? Are you about to get... Are you about to get memed on? I think we confused you, BB. Oh, Maggie's always confusing me. Are you kidding me? Have you seen how hot she is? I spend five seconds in a room and she's like, she's got my, she's got my knickers in a twist. My, my panties. Just, I want to clarify the, the British version. I know that sounds close to something else, but obviously in context. Tournament is on the 23rd at 7 p.m. Um, I'm going to meme on everyone. Oh, I thought it was today. 
I could have sworn it was today. I love a good bonfire. Maggie, Maggie does. I love a good bonfire too. Um, I don't know. D does anyone does anyone enjoy going out like in the fall and and walking outside and you smell like that like wood stove wood burning environment? Anyone? Anyone have that at all? Like ever? It's like one of my favorite things seasonally. I do love that. It'd be like that sometime. You're you are making your way longer. Just go to the bonfire and the elevator and go through the door you opened. Well, no, 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 Ansika. I was trying to I was trying to farm one more level since I was so close to being able to uh, just level up. So I figured I could go in here and kill some smaller troops and then use that in order to, to get my level that I was looking for. Yeah, yeah, I, 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 I mean, I know that I can. I know that I can just go up through that middle door, um, which I don't even I don't even need to take the elevator, right? Oh, do, do do I need to take the elevator? Uh, love Mitt. Thank you so much for the subscription. Thank you for armoring up with us. How are you? How's your day? How's uh, how's Tarkov? How's the reset? Um, I smell year-round neighbors cook and use wood for warmth. Ooh, that would that would light me up. Let me tell you. I just I love that smell. I really love that smell. You got uh, free humanity. Love it when that happens. Is that what? So is it? Is it just randomized? Like how you get them? Okay. So someone said something about the elevator, but I don't even need to use an elevator, right? Like I go up the stairwell, this thing right over here, and then I go through the front door, and that's that's the front door to the cathedral. So I could run right past the knights and then pop the orb, and then I get automatically sent into the invading world, and then no big thing, right? I don't have to go back up the elevator. Uh, not too bad cheaters. Tarky is fun, but also loads of... Wait, now there's tons of cheaters? I don't feel like that was ever a problem. Colors in the fall is the big thing for me. Well, listen, colors in the fall plus a good golden hour shot. So, like, I do photography for fun. And I, I don't do it a ton. Maggie's like, no, you don't. Get out of here. Um, I, I, don't, I don't go out that often. I really don't. Um, but I do understand the principles and the dynamics. You know, the some of the technical aspects to photography and like the golden hour in the fall is a really really good time of the year i just wish we had a more um vibrant ecosystem here ohio's not too great cheaters fueling the rmt market killing mods in every area before killing the boss can give max 10 soft humanities Oh, mobs, mobs, so like regular enemies. I need to go back up and level up. Um, the issue comes up where the animations cause them to twist their shoulders and whatnot. They're facing one direction, but the model looks like they're facing off to the left. Yeah, 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 yeah. So what you're actually looking at is not directionally, um, uh, not directionally accurate to the model of what we see versus what's actually happening behind the scenes of the game. Uh, Drake's Bells drake bell's going to jail wait what i don't i don't even know who that is if i'm being honest who who is that i've heard this name recently a couple times and i don't know i don't know what it is i don't know who that is What is that? Is that like a TV series? I, I would assume. Was it like on? Was it on like Nickelodeon or something? Like I'm not familiar with this. The, these two individuals. No, if you kill a humanoid enemy, save for a few exceptions, you start gaining points per kill. There's no way to see these points. They're just in the background, unique to each area. So when you first get into an area, you only need say 100 points, then 1,000, then five. Oh, okay, gotcha, gotcha. Wow, the joke there. Operation Streaming Fist with the joke. Listen, I, I've I've had the conversation about um Maggie and I were just actually talking about it. Like the whole grooming concept and how uh a lot of people 
in a position of power and prominence will take an opportunity to groom individuals in order to get them to become part of some elaborate relationship that they start crafting before they reach age. And it's something that's so common, not only within streaming, but gaming industries, um, you know, pop culture, uh, Hollywood actors, things like that. And it's a scary thing. And I, I think that one of the things that we need to do as a society is start to teach our children of any identification what to look for and what warning signs there are so they know what to expect and they know what's like, hey, this is a red flag. Something's going on. And I need to keep my eyes peeled for that. And I think part of that, hey, emo goggles, welcome back to the vault, by the way. I think part of that comes to the, the, the point, too, that we need to have conversations and we need to have strong relationships with our... Oh, my gosh! Dwellers! Dwellers, get down! Get, get down, get down, get down! Get down! Oh, shit! Captain E-Rock. Hello. Welcome. First off, I want to say, E-Rock, thank you so much for sharing your community with us. Greatly appreciate it. Let's check it out real quick. This is E-Rock. Outstanding human being. You've seen many things throughout your life, but not a whistling pile of leaves. You idiot. <laughs> lit so um i was gonna say maggie i was literally watching her play your stream raiders like all day she's been placing troops on your battlefield she keeps you up like 99 percent of the time guys for anyone who doesn't know iraq e is an outstanding creator originally that we met through mixer way back in the day and have had the wonderful pleasure of interacting with previously huge variety streamer all across the board just about every single type of game i've ever seen uh seen him play but i would greatly recommend it go and check him out stop by sometime guarantee you'll have a laugh if you like stream raiders massively massive community around that phenomenon and he's even done a lot of stuff for uh videos for them as well so like seriously he's a large representative huge proponent for it I guarantee you, if you've ever been looking to try and like level up your characters and just constantly win fights, that's the way to go. Maggie heavily relies on that Be because he his whole community has just made that such an awesome adventure, both literally and metaphorically. Um, Captain E Rock, again, thank you for sharing your community. For anyone who's not familiar, my name is Hammer. I'm a variety streamer here. Originally, I was over on Mixer as well. And we obviously had the pleasure to hang out and interact with uh, E-Rock. Obviously, transitioning over to uh, Twitch, I've maintained the variety sp uh, spectrum of gaming. But a lot of times you've been seeing me play shooters, um, a lot of Apex and things like that. But I'm starting to go back to the little bit of that um, single player, you know, vibey feel. So welcome and we're happy to have you. We're going to get back to some games here. I recently got to An Orlando. And this is my first playthrough. I'm playing as a Wanderer, um, as a Dex build. I just got the Chaos Blade. And the wondrous community of uh, Dark Souls has been so tremendously helping me along my way. Captain Erock, how how was the stream? How'd everything go today? Mr. Pothead, hello. Um, wait, no, no, no. I have to go back. I have to go back. I have to... I have to go throw myself into a giant fire in the middle of the cathedral and cry myself to sleep. What is this? I always lose my patience to get through these games. It was good. Almost done with the uh, FF 14 base game story. Fun day. Nice, nice. How how are you how are you liking it? If I if I may ask, how are you enjoying the title? Because I feel like Final Fantasy, and you might be able to sympathize with me a little bit. I'm sorry, I'm not trying to, you know, state your age or anything or throw any guesstimates out there. But I know I know a fellow gamer when I see one. A seasoned veteran. 
Um, I feel like Final Fantasy has just vastly diminished in quality. It starts super boring and slow, but gets better. Do you do you feel do you feel like it does any 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 respect to the original Final Fantasy stuff? Like that feeling and that vibe that you got of that just full intense immersive story or how have you been? Been a while since I've been here. Not a problem, Mr. Podhead. We're having a great time. The uh, the Dark Souls community, we've got a lot of people here that have been helping. A ton of people who've been helping. Uh, everyone's kind of like egging me on into this fight. I, I can just, I can feel everyone waiting for it right now. Um, but we're in the process of getting into that right now. We're having a fun little adventure. Just pretty much trying to avoid death. You know, whatever we can do to just not die, that's kind of where we're at. Uh, for me, uh, the turn-based game was a big no-no. So Final Fantasy Tactics was a no-no for you? Really? For me, it's like an homage or an homage to uh, all of them. There is a nod to each game in this series. Well, and I think that they always kind of have like this... Um, a pointer, if you will. A, a pointer, if you will, to say like, hey, this is this is what defined us. This is what helped us get to where we are now. And this is what made the series great. You know, that kind of a thing. And I don't know. I like I feel good about I feel good about Final Fantasy that it's made its mainstay within, you know, gaming culture and pop culture for as long as it has. But at the same time, I feel like it could just do so much more. Oh, that was that was a big win for me. That was a big win for me right there. A huge win. Listen, where where are my where are my DS heads at? I need some GGs in chat for that one, because that was some freaking hot fire. And why can't I use my Estes flask right now? That's another question that I have. Is there, am I locked down to using my flask? Like I literally, I'm not allowed? Oh, okay. What, no, yeah, why? What, no one told me that that's a thing? Yeah, but. One of them has a blocker? So I'm getting shot blocked right now. Oh. Okay, 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 okay. No, 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 don't you, don't you dare catch up to me. Don't you dare catch up to me. Don't you dare, don't you dare. Why did no one, all right. No, 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 this isn't the prepare to die edition. This is like the, the first thing. I'll be back to hang if you're still rolling. Thank you, I appreciate the lulls. Um, I will be on for a little bit. I appreciate you taking the time and and thank you so much for uh, entrusting your community with us. Eat your food, enjoy the time with the fam. Do what you got to do. I know you've been on for a little bit today. We've been watching. Um, I thought you got Estes and Remaster. I don't have the Remaster or the Prepare to Die edition. I have the standard, just baseline, just absolute, I'm terrible edition. That's what I have. Um, so when someone said something about the Estes uh, flask and it being, uh, what was it? It being like you had the maximum of uh, 10. No, 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 this is Xbox 360, technically. Um, it had the maximum of 10. It got blocked down to that. I didn't know that that's what they meant, is that it can technically still be blocked by a spell. I didn't know that that was a thing. So I, I that's all news to me. But now I understand. We'll, we'll be able to knock it out some. So I think what I'm going to try and do is do half rolls off the step because I was losing health rolling off the top and I was thinking okay well I can just flask up and no big deal 
Uh, did they Lloyd's you or whatever? I don't know what that is. I don't know what that means. I'm sorry. Also a throwable that does it too. I don't think they hit me with anything in terms of a throwable. Lloyd's talisman blocks Estes. Oh, uh, I don't, I don't think, I don't think so. Am I, am I using any of, any of that? I don't think I'm using any of that. They have to throw it. Oh, I don't think they threw anything. I don't think that they threw anything, but I'm not positive. They have to hit you with, okay, okay. So then, yeah, I don't think, I mean, the only thing that I've gotten hit by is the uh, the ranged attack just there. And then I had that one uh, parry block attack that I got off. I'm assuming it's probably one of the other two that was doing something, like, cause I can't use my flask at all. And it's not gonna matter if I bop, uh, pop down to 18, cause like, oh, come on. If I hit B like three or four times, it should just back me the whole way out of the menu. Just the whole way out. Yeah, there's gotta be a spell or something because the moment I, I, I spawn in, you know, of course they're both glowing. You know, the one on the left and the one on the right are both glowing. And then the, the main person that's back in the back, they're like, hey, everything's great. I'm just going to attack you with my fists, you know? So I don't know. I mean, they, the moment I get in here, it's already blocked. So I, they've got to have something that's on. I really don't like that, but okay. All right. I guess we'll stick to it then. So I'm going to run in there. I'm going to see if I can do the roll off and get the caster to try and like cast, cast shots at me so that that way I can hit behind him again like I did previously. I can't let the, the scythe person up here. That's going to cause me a lot of dilemma. Okay, so it's still on. I don't have a way to heal yet. Oh my gosh. Holy crap, those, 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 they just hit so hard, but please. I can't, I can't get the shield one alone. Don't forget, if you need, you can run all the way around. Oh, all the way around the top. Oh, and then come back down. Okay, well, that I can work with. Come on up, come on up. Oh my gosh, I got that person to damage, uh, what is it, Loratech? Loratech? Looks like we're getting some revenge, I, I guess. I have no idea what I'm doing. By the way, Entropic Effect, welcome back. Happy to have you here. 
I'm not doing well today. I'm having this issue where one of the people is blocking my Estus flask and I have no way to heal myself. And I'm really not about that noise. Really not about that noise. Maybe I can just do like massively fast laps and come up behind the other person. Get the opportunity to just split them up a little bit. Just constantly run over and over and over again and put myself slightly ahead. Because I'm outpacing this person. Uh, I'm outpacing the person with the shield, but I'm not outpacing the person with like the double scythe. Don't be silly. You're doing amazing. I don't know about that. I think that that's a stretch. I'm just, we're, we're just, we're trying out here. That's for certain. Uh, and your sword is getting better for every humanity you use. Caps at 10. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it's like 20 for the first one. And then the next two levels are 10 damage a piece um, for each humanity stack. And then after that, they do like a rotating six to seven or something like that. Shoot, run, shoot, run. Especially against Lautrec, his parry skills are insane. So spamming R R1, RB is dangerous. Oh, good. Good, yeah, good. That's that's what I want. I don't know why I can't lock on from a longer range. That's something that bothers me. That was a good shot though. And I've got I've got the arrows that I can probably do what I need to do in terms of damaging them and killing them. Um and then, you know, worry about doing what I have to, but if I can kill him, like you guys had said, if I can kill him, then uh, the other person dies. So I just have to set myself up. Does he heal at all? Oh my gosh. Uh have you had a go against O and S? I have no no, I don't I don't think so. This is all I've done thus far. I'm just trying to not just die. If I remember correctly, he has Estus, but only a limited amount. I don't think I have enough arrows for that. I I really don't think I have enough arrows for that. Oh crap. I've got to get a gain on him again. So much for speedrunning tactics, right? <laughs> We're in them for the long run. Yeah, I know, right? Sorry. I wish I could... I wish I could cheese, like, over the edge, like, just enough that they would get... They would get, like, pissed off and come, like, chase after me, you know? And I don't like that you can't lock on for, like, an impressively long distance. Oh, I was hoping he would fall. Ooh! Okay, off we go, off we go, off we go! Ah, run! That was a good one. That was a good one. That was a good little opportunity. So I, I kind of sped up the fight just a little bit there. Just a wee bit. Not a ton. All right, so down we go. Down the next edge. Someone's attacking? Okay. I hope it's not the Paladin. Oh, was that was that Lotric that just fell? Forty-seven. Okay. Oh no! That was really bad. See, this is why I don't like lock on. 
I don't like it. I, I the, the lock on doesn't work like a lock on should, in my opinion. Uh, propaganda, hello, how are you? Just beat Sens and arrived in Honor Londo. That's fantastic news. We're in the process of fighting some ridiculously impossible boss set, and um, I'm crying on the inside as everyone slowly says you can do it. Um, and I second guess all of my existence. That's pretty much where we are right now. Uh, apparently there's some sort of like hidden realm that you invade, kind of like M Miranda, Melinda. M I don't remember what that person's name was, but someone, someone we, someone we invaded. Ooh, Wraith, how is work? Wait, you work today, right? Yeah, you work today. Yeah. Yeah, you're a person. Oh, come on. No, no. Oh my gosh. No, please, 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 please. I'm a, I'm a real boy. I'm a real boy. I'm a real boy. Just let me run. Just let me run. Big daddy woo woo steps. Come on. Come on. One foot in front of the other. One foot in front of the other. That's not what I wanted, but that's fine. One foot in front of the other. Oh, they took the shortcut. They dropped off. They took the shortcut. Okay, I got a hit in but I really don't like my position right now. He can't parry you if you whack him while he's swinging or if you're behind him. Oh, okay, so the idea is he can't parry and do that like one kill if he's already kicking my ass. <laughs> hey, look, if he's if he's already wiping the, the floor with your face, he can't do anything at the same time. If you attack him while he's doing that, it's no big deal. He can't stop you. Just pinch him a little bit. Tell him you don't like him. Please stop. Please stop doing everything that you're doing, game. I don't like it. It's terrible. You also outrange his weapon a little bit. Well, that's good. Okay, I swear, if I would have lost the Iron Golem fight, I would have been back at... Uh, Andre's bonfire. Is that the main bonfire? Like over the, the firelight area? Is that what that is? Am I getting that right? Being right behind him doesn't mean he's kicking your ass. Ugh! That ghost scared the ever living crap out of me. Yeah, I did work today. It was kind of shit, but I'm glad to be off. Wraith, I'm glad you're off. What are you, uh, what are you up to tonight? Are you playing any Apex? What are you getting into? It means you're kicking his ass. No, it means I'm crying on the inside. Is that's what that's what you mean, right? Hmm. All right, I think I think the paladin's down to one shot. Literally, I think the paladin's down one one hit away. I'm probably just gonna rot in bed. I'm so sore. I'm sorry, Wraith. I know you work hard. I know you work real hard for your. You work hard for the money. You work hard for the money. I'm sorry that you've got to go through some some crazy nonsense, but. I'm glad, I'm glad that at least, I don't know how today was, but you know, based off of your statement yesterday, you had some, some really good work around, you know, the quote unquote bottle style service, you know, you popping. Okay. Bye. Bye. I had fun. Bye. I got one, one, six, one damage. Lol. You have fun. Okay. Bye. Thank you, thank you. Uh, today was not it, I'm sorry. I'm sorry I didn't, today wasn't like yesterday. Hopefully that the days, 
hopefully the days that you have maintained some level of consistency around tipping and your work. I know that, you know, as you start to get back into the rhythm of things, you'll get some sort of resilience around how often you're doing it. Your body will start to get used to it. I know your body works a little bit differently, you know, because of some health things, but I, I, I think that, you know, it'll get at least somewhat, somewhat, somewhat resilient against all the damage. <laughs> it's a lot of, that's a lot of damage. It's like someone's just one clipping you with the nine, nine. You know what I mean? They're just body, body tapping you. Nope, nope, gotta run, gotta run, gotta run, gotta run, gotta run, 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 I have a plus 10 Kuchi Katana, nice, I'm glad that you got the Kuchi Katana as well, I just upgraded to the Chaos Blade, so I've got the Chaos Kuchi, everybody loves a good Chaos Kuchi. This guy was yelling at me because cigarettes are $10 per pack. And he's like, why is it I go through the drive through and they're seven? And I'm like, I don't control the pricing. Yeah. And you're like, also go get them at the drive through then. It's fine. I'll wait. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. In Inside of a casino, you're getting them table side. Do you get them table side at the drive through? <laughs> Yeah, but I have to, like, get up. Exactly. Exactly. These were brought hand to you. Right to right to your palm. I, I, I appreciate, by the way, that you guys have uh, faith in me, that you guys believe in my competency, that you guys believe in my ability to knock out this boss. And I know that, like, everyone's just... This is not a nail-biter. You know, huge act... Ax, ax, action. Ax, ax, action sequence, right? All right, so I got another 100 damage in on them. I'm so glad I was able to quit smoking. I'm, I'm sure, I, I know like there's a lot of people who struggle with that and everyone kind of has like different, um, you know, different things that help them get through it. And some people say like, you have to, you know, recreate the physical habit of having something in your hands. You've got to do this, you've got to do that. Like there's all sorts of stuff that people talk about and say like, hey, this is what you should do in order to, to make that happen, make it work, you know, whatever. But um, I don't know. I don't think there's any one right way to do it, but it does help the more people you have that you can talk to that can that can try and keep you, you know, your head afloat, as it were. And I don't know, I've never tried to quit personally, but. I know it's a lot to deal with. I do know that. Oh, Shep. That was bad. That was a bad thing right there. I need a major lead now. Oh my gosh, this is so stressful. And they're starting to get this like shortcut thing on me where I feel like I can't keep up and get enough of a head start to prep for an arrow shot. Oh, oh. I think I think that knight's like one HP, maybe. I, I just did an 89 attack to the knight that was in the rear. Maybe one HP. And like, I'm really tempted to pop this humanity just because I know that if I get attacked, if I get cornered, if I get anything, there's no escaping and I'm dead. Like literally no way around it. And if I lose my humanity, I lose it. Like it's gone because I'm invading, right? Ugh, I hate this invading concept. I don't I don't need this in my life. 
I don't need this stress. I'm not trying to prove people I'm better or whatever nonsense garbage. Okay, knight's down. Estes Flask is still down, so the only option I have left is healing. So Loratech or Lorek or Lartech or Lotramac or whatever this person's name is, is definitely blocking it, or the concept inv invasion is definitely blocking me from healing. So I just need to just take the time, do roundabouts, wait for an opportunity of attack. And then, you know, like, not screw up at all. Like, zero screw ups. Oh, nice! That's fantastic news, Whisper. Uh, I only smoke when there's alcohol. So, what, yeah, they, they, what do they call that? Like, social smoking? Is that what that is? It's kind of like social drinking? I think, I think that's what that is, right? Okay, so 100 damage there. I did some good damage. I want to make sure I'm not on that weird curse or whatever it is. I just lost 15k souls. No! Girl, I don't know. I was so over it today. It was not nice. I was not nice, Smiley Wraith at all. Oh, shep, I almost effed that up. I almost effed that up, Royal. Social smoking, you don't have to be drink. Oh, okay, gotcha. So it's kind of like, you know, it's like, you know, all the people go outside at work and, you know, one person smoking and then the other person smokes because they also actually smoke. And then, you know, Joe and Bob are like, you know what? I mean, I'm already out here. You know, we out here. Okay, how can how can those attacks go through my shield? I don't like that. Like if 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 the game has taught me, if the game has taught me the entire game how to play a specific way and then all of a sudden they start doing something different, like I can't I can't stand that. I cannot stand that. I also don't like the fact that the S disc is 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 blocked. That's the only way that I can heal. Besides humanity, which I just wasted all of. I don't, I don't want to do that. Like, I don't enjoy that. At all. <laughs> I can't do Benny Hill. I can't. So, Creatures of the Unknown, by the way, welcome. We used to actually have that on my old stream and Mixer. Well, yeah, I still have my six humanity. So, I do more damage with my attacks. But the problem is, is that I don't have a way to heal now. When I go back in there... I don't have a way to heal because I still have this the six that are already used. I have no heals left. So I need to rather go farm heals from rats or I need to find a different solution. You can use them if you found them. Gotcha. Yeah, so I mean the only the only option yeah, I know it's it's copyrighted. Yeah, so that's why I can't use it. Um, but the only other solution is that, like I have to go back and try and farm humanity from rats so that that way at least I have something when I am in there. If I've got like 30 of them, then no big deal. I don't think I can do it, Smeep. I don't think I can. Regardless, I need arrows. You don't lose anything when you die. So I know that no matter what, even if I go back there, like, I guess I could try and farm a couple souls on the way in, go to the blacksmith on the left, grab arrows, and then wrap my way back around into the right-hand side by the cathedral, and at least I'm good. But let's listen to you guys. You're like, just don't get, don't get hit. Don't get hit at all. There you go, ham. Like, don't, don't be a smooth brain octane. Just use your brain. Actually, so the community manager for Apex tweeted last night that they had an Octane heirloom on the way being shipped to them. And I retweeted it this morning and I was like, this is absolutely disgusting. <laughs> for, for anyone who doesn't know, I do not like Octanes. Any Octane main is like, mm -mm. practice it. Oh, okay. Everyone's like, yeah, I mean, you don't lose anything. So 
what's the negative aspect to this? Well, I'm wasting my time that I could be using leveling up my, my character to be a better character. Even Octane doesn't like Octane. Yeah, the one that commented on my YouTube video the other day. Honestly, YouTube's been really doing well. I'm very, very thrilled that we've had um, the level of, of uh, attention around it. And I was trying to think about, like, maybe I should do some Dark Souls videos, but I don't know what to add to it. Like, what what do I Dark Soul? Like, basically me just dying. Everyone's done that. Everyone's done that. And everyone's like, yeah, but do it anyways, because you're unique. And I'm like, yeah, but, like, everyone's done that. What way are you facing? What way are you facing? Truly. Uh, I did not. I did. I did not. Yeah, just don't get hit easy. I love the Doom face, by the way. That's like one of my favorite in all of gaming history. The iconic, the iconic history of 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 gaming. Doom is definitely above, above the the, the heights and highs of critical moments in time. That was so facing the rock, the right direction. Come on, I don't like these people. I don't know. That was that was it. That was it. I don't I don't care what you say game. I know I got the backstab on that. Don't at me. Doom guy kick. Um thinking of reaction videos of course, Antoine. You troll. You absolute troll. Actually, speaking of trolls, we're going to have to try and find more mods in the future. We need we need more people who can uh, mod for the mod for the stream, mod for the community. I'm gonna have to open up my uh, my application back up and and see if anyone's gonna end up being interested. Uh, I actually was in chat when Happy Hob managed to do the first no hit run. He invented it. I don't. I would say I would say the probably the more accurate description would be pioneered it right, because like people have done no hit runs. I mean, look at Super Mario. Like, they've done no death runs for forever, which is basically a hit. You get hit once at all in Mario and you're dead. On an alt, on an alt account, you're going to apply. So what you're saying is you're going to have two accounts be in the stream constantly in Dark Souls. Yeah, so they pioneered the Dark Souls version of the no hit run, quote unquote. Okay. 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 Excuse me. I'm drinking coffee. Do I look like I need your harassment right now? Coffee! How? Don't you dare. Don't you dare. I'm busy. I am busy, young man. I am busy. You stand there with your shield at attention. Do your job. You already failed. I got into the door and it's open behind you. Going to speak to your superiors. Okay, just a little quick flasky. Nice. All right, so now to buy some arrows. What? Uh, everyone said it was impossible and it took him years. I've seen many times when mods should time out or give warnings or ban and even just pay attention and they don't. I mean, that's basically me. Even when I'm trying to mod for my own chat, um, I just, I just get, I just, I don't pay attention. Oh, poison arrows. You're a genius. Entropic effect is a genius. 
You want to talk about high level play? I'm getting ready to go into a fight where arrows make or break combat. An entropic effect is like, what if you defile their blood? <laughs> Pretend the sneeze never happened. What if you defiled their blood and watch them wither away before your very hands? See, this is why I don't Dark Souls. Long way back might be worth it. Extra points if you dung pie him to... What? How much does one dung pie do in damage? One? Like... Is there a way that I can give... That I can give Lawtrek a sepsis? And then, like, just stand back at the fire for, like, the next 17 years and farm souls to say... To stay sustained to the point where they just, like, they, they wither away and just die? Yeah, I got blood poisoning. Dung pie will inflict toxic. Just be careful. Wait, it'll inflict toxic on me for tossing it? What do I do? Eat the stuff? Am I that confused that it's actually a pie? What is wrong with me? What if I just use Dragon Slayer arrows instead of standard arrows? Or if I use large arrows? Because right now I'm only using standard. I have 111 of those. What if I just start buying a bunch of these, like, large damage arrows? Should I genuinely go back and find poison arrows? Where are these things? Where, where do I find these things? Is it worth the, the visit? You guys know me. I mean, you could parry and use your... What, do you think I'm good? Creature, do you think that that's a sensible thing? You just watched me fail at literally the last moment in time. One attack away. One attack. One sliver. One iota. Of life force. And I botched the roll. Oh. What's the difference between feather arrows and standard arrows? Like. Why? Why is a feather arrow 100 and that does less damage than the arrow that's 50? Feather has higher range, the distance they travel. So can it lock on from further? Going backwards through Sen's Funhouse is never worth it. The distance they travel. The undead merchant female behind the bars sells. Okay, so I know which one you're talking about. I remember that one. The one that's like up through the small little thing before you get to Undead Burg or whatever. You don't have to lock on to fire. Yeah, well, it's not working. I feel like the accuracy of that is just... No, 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 that doesn't work. Uh, Entropic, it, it, that doesn't work. The aim aim thing, we found that out when I first was getting through, right before I fought um, the, the Minotaur thing on the top of the first, like, major boss that you fight after the Asylum. The one that's up on, like, the, the, uh, the catwalk between the two, like, fortress tower things. I tried to do that on... Um, the, the people throwing those bombs down up on those little wooden ledges, I tried to aim up there and there's no way to do it. Otherwise, I would have done it. And everyone was like, yeah, it's just because you have the other version. But they added that back in or something. And everyone said that's something that they also had in DS3. Uh, I think if you shoot them with arrows from outside of their range by using first person mode, they don't chase you down. I don't have first person. That's the problem. Otherwise, I listen. It'd be like Counter-Strike 1.6. I'd be like peak popping and just like firing shots and then wandering off and it'd be like Hawkeye up in here. I don't know if you guys have seen me with the bow check in Apex, but... No, 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 it doesn't, it doesn't work.
two two hand it. You have to two hand it. No one could help me figure this out until just now. You have to put it in two hand mode in order to do that. Two. The hell is the difference? Oh, that's not bad at all. That's not, yeah, that's not bad. Though the projectile time is very slow. I'm back, hello, welcome back. 2020, happy to have you back here. All right, so I guess I just need to buy some arrows and then I'm just gonna just not suck. Everyone tells me, just don't suck, Ham, don't suck. Don't be bad, don't be bad. Just get behind him and backstab him. Dodge his attacks, don't get hit. I used five humanities last time in order to stay alive. And this time you're suggesting I go in there with zero. Yeah, but I haven't I haven't needed it before. I've had my shield out the entire time and the game's never had any problems with me firing arrows. Not once, not any time at all has this ever been an issue. I can still fire. Uh, I do, but I don't want to use them. Sorry, what? Did you say something? Can I just, can, I just want to sneak in here. I just, no, I just want to sneak in. It's fine. It's fine. I've got an appointment today with the priest. I've got an appointment. It's fine. Don't worry about it. I, I was supposed to come in today. It's fine. They wanted me. They actually requested me. They, they asked for my presence. It's fine. You can stay out. You can stay outside. It's fine. I've got it. Look, look, here's my pass. See? Just right back out. I have a pass. Thank you. So rude these days. So rude. Security just is not like it used to be. Man. Divine blessing. I don't know anything about that. What's a divine blessing? How do I look this up? What's an attunement slot? Where do I find divine blessings? Is that what these are? Remedy? What is that? I don't know what that is. Might not have one. Inventory, same, same type as humanity. It's a consumable heal item. I don't think I have one. All right. What am I doing? What am I doing? This is outrageous. This is literally egregious. <sighs> Lord Shrek killed my firekeeper. Yeah, and me a couple times, propaganda. And me. And me. Here we go again. Excuse me. You guys were saying? You guys were saying? You were saying? Yeah, no, no, I tried to parry, but apparently I was a little bit too late. Apparently, I was a little too late. Caster first. No, 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 I definitely agree. Caster first. This is why, like, I just don't, I don't, like, come on. Like, obviously, they know that they made the mistake of, you, you limit your Astis Flask, but you don't need to remove it. Like, holy crepes. How many crepes do you have? Like, give me some crepes, bro. Uh... Is this the fog door boss? No, 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 no. This is like some sort of 
This is some sort of um, weird summoning invasion thing. Like, kind of like the Mildred down in uh, Blight Swamp, Blight Lands, Blight Town, Blight Village. Bl the Blightuary. <laughs> All right, never mind. I'm done. I'm done. Ham, Ham, you're drunk. Go home. Go home, Ham. How the heck have you been? Sponge of bullets. I've been fantastic. How are you enjoying that new, uh, the pictures and the, the content for the new PUBG map? What, where did you even flavor from? How are you real right now in life? How did you get here? Get the hell off my property. You have no business being here. No business being here. Now I'm screwed. Look, look, I have no heals. I have no heals. It's the same addictive broken game. Now you guys want me to fight like the long battle of long time and just slowly whittle away at random entities that I'm attempting to fend myself off from. This is my life. This is the way. Get headshot, bitch! What was that? You hacker! I saw you just, like, gliding that across the top of that surface. You absolute hack. You hacky being. One hacky boy. No, 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 no. That is not how we treat others. I'm trying to sneak in extra attacks, like, you know, do more than I normally do just so I can speed it up for you guys. Feel like I'm having an intimate encounter, encounter right now. And like, it's right before the boys asked you to get on and play Warzone with them, you know? Like you're trying to just get it done. Just, just, just knock it out of the park real fast. Maggie's somewhere like cringing right now. Oh, Shep, really? Come on! I'm trying to live and fight here. Give him a barrel roll. Do a barrel roll. Wait, there's a fap. Wait, what's a, what's the, what's the fap ring? I painted my toes. Hell yeah. What color? Aren't you a glovey boy? A glovey boy. What is a glovey boy? No, 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 no. How'd you get ahead? How'd you get ahead? How'd you? No, 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 no. This is bad. This is bad. Oh. <laughs> Antoine, that tweet that you sent me earlier, that TikTok video, your seventh time into the boss. Man, I just want to win. I'm tired of being a bitch. <laughs> I just want to be here, please. Please. It's broke. It's broke. It's broke. I broke it. I broke it. I got to keep going. Oh, my gosh. I am so sweaty right now. I feel like the temperature outside went up 30 degrees. Oh, I broke it again. Damn you, camera. Just work. Work as intended. You and your wonky camera system? No wonder you got remastered. Holy crap. It's playing like it's like, it's like playing Jet Force Gemini meets Banjo Kazooie meets Ocarina of Time. And you've got to control everything with those stupid C buttons. Oh, it's so bad. I hear you dropping down behind me. Law Trek. Allura Tech. Whatever your name is.
Come on, come on. Hey, what's up, Jacob? How are you? I'm sorry. Welcome. Only recipe for that is get good, I guess. Nice. Nice. That's a good color. It's a good color, Wraith. What? What was that? <laughs> Bro, you're being, like, literally the most rude right now. You didn't even, like, you just did this, like, sidestep, super cuck fast. You just, like, you, you wanted to tango with me? Is this a senior prom? You didn't get a date? You're trying to take it out on me? Come on. I got stuff to do. Everyone wants my attention. You can clearly see that right now. I had to fight off three people in one night. Like, be, be honest with me. Please stop. Please stop. I don't like this lock-on system. I really don't. I'm dead. I have to use arrows for the rest of this fight. I, can, I can't even attack with a sword unless it's literally a backstab. I can't. If I mess up once, I'm dead. I don't know what that is. I have no idea what that is. And I don't, I don't feel comfortable with looking. Because I know that the moment I start access, accessing my menu, like, they're going to be rushing me. I've got... The, I'm dead. Rest if fight is now? I don't know what this... I don't know what this, this ring is that you guys are talking about. Kick his shield next time that he turtles behind it? What? Ocarina of Time has better camera angles. They do. They really do, though. They do be having better camera angles. All right. What is this? What is this ring that you guys are referring to? Let me figure out if I have this thing you guys are talking about right now. Oh, my gosh. All right. So boost poise. That's not going to matter right now. Extends bow range. That would be helpful. That I could see having a benefit right now. I have a ring of sacrifice, a ring of suns, firstborn, dark moon, seance, ring of rare, ring of sacrifice of seancing, and some small stuff. It, yeah, I got nothing. The fap ring is dropped by Lotric. Forward RB. Oh, no, no, no. Yeah, that, I know how to do the kick. That I, I, at least I know that. I'm just, I know that I'm terrible at everything else. That I also know. Okay, so I think I'm going to change the wolf ring with the hawk ring because the wolf ring's not going to affect it at all. Not right now. Not right now. You find it up a ladder in the Valley of the Drakes. Okay. okay. There's all these, like, locations that I have no idea where it is. I'm just like... You guys are like, yeah, it's in the sand pit of hell, past the demons of ever spawning darkness. You found your way into the dungeon of selfless ter terror. Endless horrors await await your your every await you at every bend. <laughs> I just <laughs> I, <laughs> I've been in the Valley of Drakes. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Where where is it? Can you give me like anything? Yeah, you don't know the sand pit of hell and the dungeons of darkness? I can't say that I do, if I'm being honest. T Fuels, I'm glad you're getting some love out of entertainment out of this, because this action pack sequence that you've been waiting for right now is not it is not cutting it to the degree. The shortcut out of Blight Town is into the valley. Oh, okay, gotcha. Right, right, yeah, 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 right. Um, Hackworth, by the way, welcome back. Happy to have you back here in the vault. Kill the shiny boy. Wait, what shiny boy? Also, when did camera blur ever become, like, an enjoyable thing? Like, who, who thinks that with the blue chickens? What country am I in? Is this Gerudo Valley? Where the hell am I? Come on. F. F. Come on. 
Come on, Joe. You want to dance? You want to dance? You want to dance? Look at my foot maneuver. Look, I've been practicing P90X. I've been doing the insanity workout. I've got my beach bod ready for the summer. Oh, I'm not ready. I'm not ready. I lied. I lied. I lied. I lied. I lied. I haven't worked out enough. I'm close, though. I'm close. We're not quite there yet. Wait, what? Come on. Come on, buddy. Come on. Do it. Fire me up. Fire me down. Give me your great thrust. Let me see your penetration skills. I just walked right into it somehow. Like, I literally, I hit roll to the right, and the game's like, you want me to roll towards him? That's because you're in lock. Lock is worthless to me. It's so bad. It's so bad. So bad. Lock. Have you tried turning it off and on again? Have you have you tried turning it off and on again? I love that. I love that clip at the beginning where like they've got the whole phone set up and like they just put the phone on like that little automated machine and it just starts going through all the options. Like the person just says something and like it goes through option one and then it says something and then like it automatically records to option two. That, like, that's just that's literally tech support 101. And I love that. I love that playback of that scene. It's just so true. Man, I can't tell you. I used to actually do tech support for school, right? Like, I, I did that for my high school. And so you'd be minding your own business. And, like, it was kind of like a, you know, an extracurricular activity. You know, get your some experience in the field in case you wanted to get into computer science or any sort of IT tech degree, you know, whatever. And so, um, you know, it bo boosts your, um, your resume, right? And so you would go to like a teacher's class because they'd be like, oh yeah, I can't figure out why my computer won't turn on or do anything or, you know, whatever. And so you walk in there and like, lo and behold, you have some, you know, 15 year old, 14 year old kid, whatever the hell who decided, you know, what's going to be fun is if I literally pull the power plug out of the back of this computer and this teacher's never going to figure it out. And that's exactly what happens. Tech support walks into the room, looks at the back and says, there's no power cable. Did you try that one? <laughs> the little things, right? It's the little things in life. All right, Captain Chodopotamus. Eat arrow to the face. Get throated. Okay, okay. That works. That works. That works. I just have to I have to run around this area as much as possible to get behind the caster so that that way I can kill the caster first. If I adequately You guys just stay there. You stay there. You stay there. Don't you screw this up for me. Don't you dare screw this up for me. Poison arrows is good. Yeah, but I don't have them. And everyone said just do it. Just don't suck. That's what that's what the consensus is right now from the from the chat is don't suck ham. That's where we're at. So that's what I'm going to attempt to do. That's what we're going for. Oh! All right, come on. Run, run. 
I wish I could use that like run meme as well. Someone had suggested that. I think it was Sword Dancer was in here the other day and suggested we get the run meme. And because it's someone's like specific content and they're actually what monetized, I don't think we're gonna be able to pull that off. I can hear it. I can hear it. I can hear the readiness. I actually got an emergency call and asked if the power cable was attached. He was so angry for that question when I arrived. I found he hadn't powered on his monitor. Savage. I I love I love too that like there's a lot of that like of course I'm not an idiot, you know? And like sometimes it's simple solutions. There's no faults in it, you know? It's it's smart to check. You never know. That's that's the process of elimination. You just go through go through the mechanics until you figure out whether or not that's it. He just tried to fist me. That dude just tried to fist me. I'm the king of fisting. I'm the king of fist. I'm the king of fist. Don't you dare. Don't you dare. Do you know who I am? Dude, I'm a caustic main, bro. I will gas trap your ass. Get off me. It's hard to keep calm, though. Yeah, no, I get it. I get it. That's part of the that's part of the hustle, right? It's part of the hustle. All right, one what? What? Get off me. Get off me. Mm. What is the old saying? If you assume you make out an ass, uh, you make an ass out of you and me. Yeah, I think that's I think that's right. That's pretty much that's pretty much the saying that people use. Come on. I should just almost not have armor. Make out an ass. That sounds like that sounds like someone's having a good night somewhere, you know. Ooh. Okay. Okay. Come on, Ham. Come on. I'm a little bit behind. I can't turn around and do a double shot here. I'm gonna have to loop around. I really, man, I've been wasting so much time with this fight. I really wanna progress into this, but like I'm putting all my energy into this right now. At least I have six humanity into it. So if they drop something, it's a lot more likely that I'm gonna get whatever it is. Come on. Jump up, jump up, uh, get down. Okay, not worth it, not worth it, not worth it. Don't screw around with it. A long time. It's a day to remember. A day you would never forget. I mean, I think it shows up on... I think it shows up on Twitter. No, it's... It's a day that you would never forget. You should never forget. Oh, okay. I got I got a 61 in. So that I'll take it. I'll take it. I feel bad for everyone just like casually watching, grabbing popcorn, getting alcoholic beverages, trying to sustain themselves through the agony of that which is this moment. 
You got you got it now? Yeah. It's an easy one. Once once you know. Once you know. If you know, you know, right? If you know, you know. Come on, come on. Come on, get up there. Get up there. Get up there. Plunging attack? No, no plunging attack. I hate that the mechanics of getting out of the bow are so challenging. That's not a long time, though. It's not a terribly long time. I'm, I'm actually really, really excited because uh, Meggy booked this like whole trip in that time period um, for us to go down and have like this uh, little adventure. Just, you know, like just just the two of us. We can make it if we try just the two of us. Mm, you and I. So that was, that is rude. That is so rude. You are so rude. Drop attacks is good and safe. No, they aren't. No, they aren't because the time that it takes for my person to, to, um, recompose themselves afterward is going to leave me open unless it happens to hit both of the individuals. I cannot heal. I do not I do not trust myself in that situation 2020. I really don't. If I could heal, that would be a different that would be a different conversation because then I could just top off, I could run back, I could I could level back up, you know, top back off to full health reapproach combat if I have to, you know, something like that. But this is not one of those times. Come on. Don't some some say being born earlier is better. I'm born in December, so I should be effed up doing great. I wait, what? Why, why would that be, why would that be harder for you? Well, when you open a door, you can't get hit. Wait, what? What, what are we, are we on about something different now? I don't understand what's happening. I feel like the smarter thing isn't to stop here, but is to go up the entirety of the whole stairwell and then see if I can hit them on the major stairwell up. Can I? I wonder. Oh. Two down. I don't know how it wasn't a backstab, but whatever. Uh, if you think this is hard, don't play DS3. The combat is way faster and more brutal. Yeah, but I feel like um, from what I've heard, like it's it's more more forgivable in spots. Does that make sense? So like, you know, there, there's more opportunity that you can actually do like correct parries, correct blocks because the timing and the frame rate is better. So like it's more it's more doable from the player's perspective. I don't mind the combat for this. I don't I, I do not like that it is unfair that I cannot heal. I think that's bullshit. Parry is harder in DS3. See, I, I feel like there's definitely some challenges to parry. 
I, I think I do okay. I mean, I started to learn that a little bit in the Ghost of Tsushima and how important it was to really kind of get that down. And I know that they're a little bit more helpful in uh, a game like Ghost of Tsushima and even like, you know, Arkham Asylum, Arkham Knight. They're a little bit more uh, upfront about the timing for that. But I still feel good about this game in general in um, my ability to learn it and, and learn the combat, learn the pacing, learn the timing. I don't feel awesome. But I feel okay. Like, I feel like I do okay. That hit his legs. There's a hundred. Ghost is such a great game. Absolutely. You're going to get some shiny armor when you're done. I hope so. I'm going to, and like, I'm not even going to end up using it because it's going to be too and heavy. Like, the whole point of the game is to, like, try and stay as light as humanly possible so you can run fast and be fast. But they're really, really destructive on how much a person or a player can benefit from speed. Like, that's the only other thing that I don't like it is that um, they, they, thus far they have, like, very contradicting concepts on what's a requirement from the player in order to be good, quote unquote. It's it just it makes it it makes it taxing. Like, how am I supposed to accomplish this? I feel like I'm somehow... I'm somehow slower. Am I slower as two-handed wield? Is that right? Havel Ring helps a lot. Uh, do, do, do I have that? I got, like, all of the... Uh, I got, like, all of the armor for that character, I feel like. But I don't know if I got the ring. You have to be... You can be... You can be tanky so that bosses can't really hurt you. Me looking away actually really screwed up that rotation. I apologize. I'm not blaming anyone. I'm just saying, like, looking at that and then trying to make sure I've got this down. I'm a little bit behind on my loop right now. Uh, ring you get from killing the guy at the bottom of the tower by the Taurus demon. Oh! Okay, yeah, the person who, like, literally one-shots me, they changed the parry window in DS3. It's more narrow, but as always, the third consecutive strike is almost a free parry in any of the games. Gotcha. Yeah, I feel like, like, after after specific attacks, like, you can you can kind of learn each each combatant, any each enemy, and you can you can get the, the pacing or the timing to just fight them to where it's, like, cheese mode, you know? You just don't have to think about it. Like, you're going to be fine. Everything is going to be fine. You're going to melt people. And, um, I don't know. I, I think, I think if I, if I give it the time, it'll be easy. I just have to spend the time. All right. We're almost there. We're, we're, we're getting there. We're getting real close. I can feel it. That's a biggie in PvP. Don't try to strike three times in a row. Gotcha. Yeah, I don't plan on PvPing, like, at all, ever. I, I just don't have an interest. I'm not here to, you know, play against other players or do anything. I, I don't care about that. I just want to have fun with the game. I like the challenge of the game and what makes it interesting. I don't need the, the player involvement. I, I'm, I'm not here for the extra moments. PvP is fun in another way. Well, yeah, because I think it challenges your your uh, combat knowledge, right? It challenges your patience, excuse me, by the way. It challenges your patience, your understanding of different weapons, how weapons are used. And I would say, like, the person with the most knowledge can end up being one of the stronger players to play against, right? But I don't care enough about the game to invest that much energy into the knowledge base so that I can be good at PvP. Because I know how I am. If I start getting into it, I'm going to want to really get into it. And I don't care that much. At the end of the day, I know I'm not going to devote that much time to it. So why, why try? Stop. Stop. You stop right now. Yeah, yeah. Roll. Screw it up. Screw up your run. Screw up your runtime. 
you can summon friends to play it. Yeah, I heard that about Dark Souls 3, uh, that they're a little bit more open to people playing together instead of it being like, you know, you can only fight for like one boss or something. Is that accurate or is that not accurate? It's fairly accurate. Gotcha. Is that when it was? Is that the date, Antoine? Oh, are you going? What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you, what are you doing, Antoine? What are you, what are you doing? Listen, if you're trying to do what I think you're trying to do, just hit the search button at the top and then... You know, search for, search for specific key phrases. I'm not doing anything, lol. I don't believe you. Uh, the summoning is pretty much the same in both games. Dark Soul 3's... Uh, Dark Souls 3 is better for co-op, but for different reasons. So wait, is it accurate that that you can have friends in for a longer time than just for a boss fight? Or does it work differently? Like, is it actually the same or is it not? Which, welcome back, by the way, uh, Ghost Recon. Happy to have you back here in the vault tonight. How are you doing today? Come on, I'm so close to finishing this. I don't want to do it. I don't want to do it. I don't want to risk it. Don't risk it, Ham. You've got this. Don't get cocky. Don't go in for the last swipe. Don't do it. Don't do it. Just play smart. Don't do it. You tried that last time and it didn't work. Don't do it. So he drops. Thank you, Chaos D85. Thank you. Thank you for the GGs from Entropic Effect. Fun to watch. Ansica 2020. Everyone, guys, thank you so much. Thank you for the support for sticking sticking by me the entire time. You got his ring. Put it on. It's the best ring in the game. Wait, really? Uh, boost HP, stamina, load, bra breaks when removed? So I can't take this off. <laughs> Ever. All right. I don't like that, but whatevs. Take that soul back to the fire link to revive. Oh, 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 oh. You mean the fire, the fire keeper soul or whatever that I have? I should take that back to fire link. Wait, how do I get back? Lol, dude. Why take it off if it's the best ring? I don't know. What if I want to swap hands? What if I'm feeling like my accessorizing is not good that day and I decide that I want to change the look of my character? And so in order to define who I am and appropriately esteem myself through my cosmetic nature and my fashion sense, I decide to swap it from my left hand to my right hand. And now I can't because it's gone forever. 
I've been stripped of my individuality simply because of some sort of curse? Cruel. I don't want to. I'm already stressed. I'm already overtly stressed about that last boss fight. How do, how do I get back? June of last year was when the fruit started. Wow, you're just plowing through it. PvP is one of the most disappointing aspects of Dark Souls because of the lag. Yeah, I'm sure there's a lot of people who use like lag switches and um, you know, they've got delay on the stream or delays on their game because of Wi-Fi or you know, whatever. It's like every COD lobby ever. Apex has been really bad lately too. A lot of people doing like lag switches and stuff like that, DDoSing servers. At least finally they found a way to try and uh, fight that a little bit to where it's not as debilitating to your player base, especially in ranked. Yeah, go through the big fog gate at the end of the hall. Whoa, wait, wait, where I just was? I thought, hold on. Am I supposed to go back to Firelink Shrine or am I going through the fog at the end of the hall? Because if the fog at the end of the hall is that boss from that person that we raided the other day, it wasn't Bandit. I can't remember um, her name, but we raided her the other day. And they were on that boss that literally the moment you walk through the door, they charge you with this giant pole arm and just like slice you in half. I don't want to do that. I do not remember the boss's name. I remember that there's two of them. And judging by all the context of everyone being like, have you done ONS? Have you done SNO? Have you done ONS? I'm going to guess that it is ONS. Just just throwing out a logical reasoning. Just just a little bit. Beanpole and the rock. How many different names are there for them? Just asking. This is your next boss. That's what you need to do. Yeah, but like. Do I? You have to do them eventually. Yes, I love ONS. Yes, it is ONS. Everyone knows ONS, but apparently me. Ugh, why am I here? What country am I in? What flavor am I? I think I think Ornstein sounds better. Personally, it sounds like there's just like a it's 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 like a a, a sliver away from Hornstein, which just makes you think of horny, right? Like, I think that that sounds better. That's just me. Personal opinion. So, do I have to kill this boss in order to go back? Is that an absolute necessity? They're one of three bosses you need to kill to win the game. Nah, Ornstein is hot. See, there you go. No, but yes. Okay, so were you guys saying no because technically I can go back? But you don't want to give me the information as to how. I'm thinking I just go all the way back up the stairs. I agree, but I'm weird, so I pronounce it the right way. You can go back, but not progress. I don't even know what that means. You can go back, but not progress? What? If you don't want to backtrack the long way, there's almost no point going back. Do you want to go through Sen's Fortress again? You have a boss. After the boss, you can warp between the bonfire and you can go to Firelink. Listen, listen, all right, all right, listen. Like, I I can tell how much you guys want me to try this boss. But I feel like with how excited you guys are about this, that usually that usually tells me that I'm not prepared for this fight. I was watching, I was watching that poor girl the other day immediately walk in and the moment she walked in, she was like 30 levels higher than me. The moment she walked in, just get railed, like one shot. And you guys are out here like, yeah, that's gonna be fine. How am I prepared for this? She like three times the armor quality than I do. You guys just want to put me through the ringer, I think. That's what I, that's what I think is going on here. Only took me five tries when I first played it. I have a feeling, Anska, that you're better than I am. 
Did you manage the gargoyles? Yeah, after crying emotionally and, and deciding that I didn't want to be a bitch anymore. It's the most iconic first real fight in the game. It's the first, it's the fight that separates real Souls players from those who can't handle it. It's the fight that makes people quit. I promise you I'm not lying. She beat, she beat Owen S the first time she took off all of her armor. I'm level like 40 something. 54. I'm I'm listexic. I'm sorry. I thought I was literally like 45 or 46 or something. Is the music too loud? I can't, you're are you playing music upstairs? I can't hear it. I'm actually thinking about coming up and grabbing enough of co another cup of coffee because these people want me to crack on in a threesome where all I'm going to do is get fisted and reamed for the next probably 5 hours. All right, back to it. <sighs> okay. Okay. Smurf, thank you for the 100 biddies. I appreciate it. Thanks for the party. We needed a little break real quick. Oh, I'm blasting. Oh, I'm blasting. Yeah, I can't hear it. I don't think anyone else can hear it either. Can you guys hear any music in the background? You've got the FAP ring. You'll be fine. I don't think I'll be fine, bro. I don't think I'm gonna be fine, bro. Think I'm gonna die, bro. Think I'm gonna die, 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 die. Oh, Shep. Oh, Shep. Oh, Shep. Oh, Shep. Oh, Shep. Oh, Shep. Come on down here, you big chunk. You big chunk. You big chunk. I am coming for you, big chunk. Big chunk, big chunk, chunk. Oh, Shep! Demon Ring, thank you so much for the follow. Greatly appreciated. Welcome to the Vault, and thank you for becoming a Vault Dweller. Happy to have you here. How are you today? And welcome. Welcome for a fantastic and fun time as you watch me cry and die to Dark Souls over and over and over again. I'm about to try my first ever adventure into the ONS room as everyone incorrigibly encourages me into my utter demise. I'm excited for it. I'm actually not. That's a lie. I'm lying. Man, I'd like to play some Enlisted. See what changes they've made and added. Listen, if they haven't added a Grand, I I don't I don't know how much I I'm invested. Like if I can't hear a game with a ping sound, honestly, it's one of the most enjoyable sounds in history and they're trying to deprive me of that. That's so incredibly rude. Who would do such a thing? Who does that? Who does that? Wow. Guy's got more reach than a Roomba. Holy crap, just full on sweep, bro. Jeez, you guys see that? All right, now I gotta like, cause I don't want to deal with Captain Captain Catbus up here. No Garand, no ham. I look. I think I think the Garand. Is anyone anyone big on like world? You you are. 
You are just an absolute, an absolute dick. A dick. I'm, I'm letting everyone know I hate this right now. Already, I hate this. I hate this. Fun to watch. Thank you so much for the 400 biddies. A herd of turds. Hello. How are you? We're just getting ready to jump into some sort of weird combat fight where every, everyone's like some 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 sort of some some sort of BDSM sadomasochist that want me to just constantly throw myself at a brick wall and injure my own face. So that's where we're at. My nards! Oh! <laughs> I gotta I gotta tell you right now. That up front, that fight right there, like I felt, I felt good about some of those initial combat, like little, like the swipe and the the overhead smash and the slam, with that huge hammer attack where he was just trying to like grind my gears. I I felt all right. I feel like I don't have the opportunity for a parry with these people. I'm, have you seen the size of his hammer? Have you seen that? He's at least twice as thick as me. You can parry? You can't parry. Okay, that's what I thought. That's what I thought. Kill the dragon slayer first? I, I don't even know which one the dragon slayer is. How are they both not capable of slaying dragons? Have you seen the size of their peepees? They're throwing it on my face right now. And I've got a lot of egg going on. Let me tell you. If you kill Smaug first, you get a cool ring. Yeah, but is it going to be better than the rings that I'm using? Like, I can't take the one off. Skinnier is Onstein and fat is Smarg. 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 Nice. Got it. And you get Ornstein armor, which looks dope. So, wait, wait, wait. If I kill Smoji first, then I get the ring. But if I kill Ornstein first, I get the armor. Is that correct? Yeah, yeah. The little guy seems to be like he's going to be way more challenging just because he's got that like literally cross the map lunge. Like, I, how am I supposed to fight that? And you get the armor of whomever you kill last. Oh, so whoa, 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 wait, you get the armor of whoever you kill last. What does Ornstein drop if I kill Ornstein first? What the hell is Super Ornstein? Is Super Ornstein what happens after I kill Smijaoyu? 
Is that like phase two? Like you kill his brother and he's like, bro, I'm big pass. Yeah, phase two. Okay, phase two, phase two. Got it. Got it. Don't let the fight intimidate you. You'll see what happens. He big piss. How did he make it into a cathedral? How is that? How is that's not right? That's not that's not right. Which again, by the way, fun to watch games. Thank you so much for the 400 biddies. I'm sorry that it might not have been the most best, greatest, most fantastic time to hit party. If you would ever like me to redeem one, you just tell me we'll make it happen. I am I? Are you guys sure I'm ready for this? Like. I feel like I should at least be more levels than what I'm at right now. I don't think I'm I'm here where I'm supposed to be. Demon Ring, do you do you play Dark Souls by the way? Are you a Dark Souls veteran? We have a lot of veterans here. I like to ask, you know, and try and get to know people a little bit. You guys all think I'm ready for this. My my best friends in my life are all sadomasochists. <laughs> I play this too much. Uh, I love it. Okay, Demon Ring. Well, we're happy to have you here. This is my first endeavor through this game. I'm I'm pleased to know that you're you're willing to come watch me fail through it. So. DS1 is by far my favorite. Is that like the consensus from the community? Because like when I watch, if I'm just being honest, when I watch, I see a lot of people who are still playing DS1 and not nearly as many people who are still playing DS3 or like any of the other games like Bloodborne or Sekiro or anything. Like, is that like, is that like everyone's view is just, bro, DS1, 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 three is my favorite. Dark Souls 1 superior, just be patient, read the fight. Don't let them intimidate you. It's just another Dark Souls moment. Listen, I'm not intimidated by the fight. I don't think that that's necessarily the problem. I think I think that I feel like I'm inadequately prepared for the fight because I haven't leveled my armor. I haven't done anything else to to prepare myself to to fight these two, and I just personally don't feel like I don't feel like me having the chaos blade is a good thing just because of the amount of damage that it does to me simply for slicing and dicing and mincing and icing slowly and coldly do i bring death upon my foes as it riddles its spiny thorns back into my palm most like one a lot like hold on hold on that's that's a hard breakdown some say DS3 is best, but yeah, no. I've only played DS3. Is that because of the new game plus, you think? You have 20 Estes. Don't worry about Chaos Blade. We all can say Dark Souls 2 isn't as good. I think everyone said that. Someone, when I was in one of the chats the other day, they said, yeah, Dark Souls 2 is really good. And I was like, uh... I'm getting like like a 95% like a kind of like a read from people that that's not true. Like most people are like, no, you're, you are wild. You are wild. But it is a good or great game. Okay. Is it worth me? Is it worth me playing? Or are you guys saying like, just, just skip that. Skip that ass. It is straight ass. Unless you were like really into an ass. Are you an ass person? That's the question. Because if you is, then smash it. Don't waste your time. If you have two, try it. If you don't have two, move on. Okay, I do not have two, so moving on. Don't skip. Okay. All right, so we found the divide. <laughs> We've we found the divide among the Dark Souls community. Is Dark Souls 2 really worth it? 
Well, you've come to the right place. We're going to explore the potential of whether or not Dark Souls 2 is worth the time. Streamer decides for themselves. Yeah, but listen, listen, I have friends, right? If I if I trust my friends and I go to a movie, or they they all go to a movie, they, they everyone, everyone. Like I'm I'm wrapped up, I'm I'm spending time with my girlfriend, whatever. We're hanging out, we're gonna we're gonna spend time inside the house, take care of my cat, whatever. Watch a movie together at home. And my friends go and see a movie. They get back from the movie and they say, I'm gonna let you, I'm gonna let you dwell on that creature of the unknown apparently it is close enough that you recognize it and that is a very wonderful compliment to me thank you um and i know that probably wasn't directional but at least it's close enough that you're you got it just think i'll give you hints if i have to um If my friends all go to see a movie and they get back and they tell me it is absolute garbage, I'm going to trust them. Right? Like, yeah, a person should be able to decide for themselves, but if it's a waste of time and money and resources, is it? The person iconically defined the role... I'm gonna die right here. The person iconically defined the role that I did the impersonation for. And arguably, he's the best voice for that portrayal of the character. I'm working on it. It is Hamill's Joker. Oh, yes. You've got it right. <laughs> that is actually it. Oh. It almost sounded like another character for oh that I mean, Hamill might have played another character within Dragon Souls or sorry yeah Dragon Dragon Souls Dragon Souls the new series coming out next Friday on Cartoon Network oh Shep I need this I need this or I'm dead this is this is so unfair I can't roll through his nuts. I couldn't roll through his nuts. Guys, should I fight Sif? I have the crest. I'm level 47 and I have the plus 10 Kuchi Katana. Wait, have we... Have we... Have we started a trend with the Kuchi Katana? <laughs> I feel so bad. People are going to come into this stream and be like, listen, you're an absolute ass for calling it that. How dare you? Dark Souls came out before you were born. <laughs> You, you pimply get, you have no respect for the Dark Souls genre. Sorry. The Ooch Gooch is not my jam. I like the beef sword. Chat, can he roll for backstabs in this fight? Can you backstab them? I should fight Sif after Ornstein and Smaur out of Jig. I have no idea who Sif is. 
Yes, you can sif. Oh my gosh, are you, are you already past where I am, propaganda? Or I, I'm sorry, you said prop. Call you prop. I'm gonna, I'll, I'll get used to it. It's gonna take some time. I'm terrible with names. I apologize. Prop. Are you already up to where I am? Oh. His name is just Sumo without the U. Some. So, so, sm smo? Smaumen? Sm, sm. I don't get it. Sm, smirish. S'mores. Got it. Come on, s'mores. Come get your chocolate. I got a little, little graham cracker crust for you, buddy. I'm doing a little baked goods action. Gonna drizzle some caramel. Come on, Captain S'more. Let me show you some s'more. Kuchikajan attack! Ooh. Wow. This is just so cruel. This is so cruel. My life is cruel. Uh, leaving Sif until after the DLC is pretty cool. So we were talking about the DLC and because I don't have like the remastered version or something like that, I don't know if I'm going to have access to it. Because someone was like, well, it still exists. I was like, yeah, but you'd have to pay for it. And like, I don't have that. I don't have the option. Like, I don't think the storefront is even around. So backstabs seem like a hard idea. Okay, so wait, wait, wait. Is it, is it possible to backstab them? You can do it? Gooch in the cooch attack. I love this. Hold on. We're going to allow that. That's that's going to that's going to we're going to pass that through. We're going to allow that. You cannot. Okay, so pretty much just get wreck nerd and die. And then deal with deal with one of them going hyper attack. Great. 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 Yeah. This is this is what I wanted in my life. This is exactly what I expected in my life. In my life, she has burst like the music of angels, the light of the sun. In my life. I'm ready to run. Um, I'm just full of bad ideas. It's, have you seen me play Herd of Surds? You're going to have to go back and watch the VOD. You should definitely kill S'more Face first. Don't waste your Estus fighting these guys, though. No real point. Well, I'm terrible. Entropic Effect. Entropic Effect? What? What? All right. Someone someone, take me home. I got to go. I'm drunk. I don't even drink. I didn't, I didn't even drink. What's wrong with me? Do it. Do it. Give me your give me your swiftest lunges, boy. Oh, I rolled under that. Okay, so the timing was a little bit different, I think. I feel like I rolled under it, but I think I was maybe just slightly early from that attack. I don't know. I am. I, I do have trouble mouth. I do. I do. Um listen. Listen, I don't think I don't think I don't think I've got it. I don't think I've got it right now. I've, I've spent all of my focus energy trying to fight the enemy combatants of of the three headless horsemen who were trying to kill me earlier. I don't think I can pull it off. I'm just confused. I have the core of the golem, Kulag soul, and I got the right of kindling from pinwheel and accidentally ate the soul of the butterfly. What if every time you died, you lost more, more health because that's DS2? I just don't, I don't think I have it in me right now. I know that I can do it. I don't think that I have it in me currently.
So... Imagine normal people listening to people talk about Dark Souls. I have no idea, prop. So... What, what does that end up meaning that, like, you can't you can't use because you don't have the soul of the butterfly like you can't do some sort of covenant thing or something like that is that what that is is that is that like that that is that the some, is there some sort of like a a ritual or rite of passage or something that occurs when you have all of these items cuz i don't know what that means But the butterfly soul is just a little bit of souls. Did you want to make the boss swap? Wait. So, like, I used the boss thing. Oh, I don't have that. Should I make that? Bottom feeder. Look at this beautiful soul, by the way, when we're talking about souls. Guys, if you haven't had the opportunity, go follow this beautiful bitch. We just stopped by her stream just the other day to watch her throw down an absolutely impressive set. You guys should take the time, drop her a follow, show her some love. She's one of the greatest people you will ever know on this entire platform. Definitely another wholesome content creator, and she's well worth the time. 10 out of 10. If you guys ever want to vibe on the weekend to some jams, seriously, she's right there in chat. Just click on her name. I guarantee you she's going to be partnered before you guys can breathe. Uh, with the soul of any boss... Uh, you can make a boss weapon, but look it up online. It's kind of complicated. Okay, gotcha. Thank you, creature. Okay, how are you? How's uh, how's work? How's the stress? How's everything going? Um, and I will work on making a death counter. Thank you for the shout out for that, by the way. Let's uh, let's take a peek. Oh my gosh, classic K. I love it. What the fuck is going on right now? <laughs> That was good. That was a good one. Just got stuck in midair. I'm good. Work is good. I'm just a little sleepy. I feel it. I could tell. I like that face that you made that it just uh, told stories right there. I defeated the golem and everything. That was such an infuriating moment. PUBG currently. Currently sitting at the bonfire where Ham is. Wow. Prop's gonna be prop's gonna be ahead of me in like three minutes. Prop's gonna be like, yeah, so I just uh I actually ran through that entire upper section of catwalks. And then I did a uh, one-shot swipe on ONS. So pretty much ate that. I think Prop just got to where we were. The brilliant light won't let me pass. Wait, what? You can't pass. What? That sounds interesting. Okay, I'm glad to hear I'm glad to hear that you're doing well though. I know um, you know, you've stated work's been stressful and I'm glad to see that you're doing stuff only on the weekends. I think that that's going to be smart for you. Tag team with Solaire for these uh bosses 2v2. Wait, can you can you summon a friend to help you fight these two? Is that possible? What? The Wizard of, of... Is that Raz? The Wizard of Raz? Hello, welcome, happy to have you. So many purple names today. So many purple names. Do I have to go down to where the gargoyle was for Kath or for Fromped? Oh my gosh. You guys are talking about all this other stuff, all these other bosses and people that I have no idea what you guys are referring to. I killed him and came back up. Sun bro will help you with Solaire. The Wizard of Raz, thank you so much for the follow. Greatly appreciate it. Welcome to the vault, and thank you for becoming a vault roller. Happy to have you here. We're just in the process of going through um, on our Londo, and we just got to the ONS boss, and I feel like I'm underprepared personally. Everyone else is saying that I'm there, and I think it might just be that I just I put a lot of energy into trying to fight the uh, the the triple pair through that black summon orb eye thing. I don't know what that was, but um, I killed two shadow phantom creature menaces from Star Wars and then killed 
Le Lestrout. And I got the ring. So now I have the ring of justice. The bright fog will go after after place Lord Vessel. Ramped is the teeth clicking dude that eats your Oh wait, they the eat eats Titanite? Doesn't have the Lord Vessel. They haven't moved through Anor Londo yet. Spider, hello. Welcome. Man, Spider, I feel so bad. I feel like every single time I'm getting close to like getting offline, you're like, you're like right there. You went to the surgeon today. Is everything all right? What's the what's the situation report? You can feed him Titanite? Oh, okay. What does he spit out? Like what is what does he give you in return? Here, since we're just sitting at a at a at a fire, we can talk. Repair equipment. Oh, my stuff's not that bad off. Talkative one, thank you so much for the host. Greatly appreciate it. Lesser forms of Titanite, but lots of it. Oh, so you give him like a whole chunk and he spews out like a whole bunch of small bits because he's grinding it up with his teeth like a popcorn kernel. I get it. Oh, I have two cysts. One's connected to the left testicle and one to... A pit... Ep, 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 epi, epididymis. Epididymis and a groin hernia. Well, that's bad. So they're trying to help you with the hernia in August. I kept on wanting to say epididymis, and I was like, nope, stop that, ham. Stop that. Well, and, and remember, I'm listexic, so, like, some of those words like that, especially when they get back to, like, Latin root and, like, weird structures, I, I, I have a little bit of a trouble. Um, you can feed him dung, and he gives you 200 souls per pot. He eats shit for souls? That's disgusting. They'll go away over time. Gotcha. Wow. Um... Wizard of Raz, happy to have you here. Do you play a lot of Dark Souls, I would presume? We've got a lot of people who've been incredibly helpful within the community of Dark Souls, um, helping us along this journey to understand how we can get through some of the nonsense that exists in this game. I don't think it's nearly as hard as people make it out to be. It, it does not come without its challenges. It's definitely, it can, it can be taxing and hard, but um, I don't think it's as bad as people make it out to be. Um, the ONS fight seems like it's going to take a little bit for me to understand and get. And um, I get it. I think it's just going to be some practice and some time. Uh, I do just got into the game last year, but have, I have become obsessed. Well, hey, there you go. I mean, as long as you're having fun with the title, that's all that matters. Um, we're we're glad I summon for ONS. What are you are you saying? Are you saying you want me to summon you for ONS? Is it just nuts to try and juggle them both for me? What? I summon Solaire. Solaire is my guy. So that would be that would be like, is it the yellow soapstone or something like that? What is that? Orange? No, orange is guidance. Banish Phantom. What? What stone do I need in order to summon him? You just have to be human to see his summon sign. Ah, so I could pop a humanity and then go back through, see the summoning sign, and then go fight ONS. So how is it like the cheap way out to summon one of those those guys to come in and fight with you? Or is it like, no, I mean, that's common. Like, you know, people do that. Like, that's considered acceptable. Or is that like the ultimate rite of passage? Like, if you can kill ONS by yourself, you're going to be fine. Don't feel bad for summoning, but you have to survive and clear the room or Slayer will fight the giants. Oh, well, I think I can fight the giants. The problem that I had was that stupid archer 
Because I killed the giants before. Yeah, you get clout if you kill without a summon. Yeah, I don't care about the clout, though. I mean, like, I, I would like to think that you guys respect me enough that that's not going to make or break the conversation here. <laughs> but who knows? But if you do summon the bosses, get a health buff. Oh, okay, gotcha. It's a bit cheap IMO. Yes, you don't get taxed for summoning. That's what it's there for. 2v2 is a fair fight, though, right? I mean, I would agree with that sentiment. I mean, I've been dealing with trying to do 3v1s constantly in Apex. I don't. I already don't like that, but, you know, that's me. Well... Spider, I hope I hope everything um, I hope everything ends up coming out all right, and you end up feeling better, and everything works out. Like I hope I hope you you got a strong fight. If you ever feel like you need to chat about anything, you know messages are always open, DMs are always open. More than happy to talk it up. You can't run up and down the stairs in ONS fight. I don't get why people stroke their egos because they solo ONS. I, I mean, like, listen, I, I can understand why someone would be excited about the fact that they fought that boss by themselves and managed to clear it. But I don't think that it's a necessity. And any person who's going out of their way to say, like, oh, yeah, I did it. Like, you're minding your own business and you're just like you're in the middle of, I don't know, freaking Blight Town. And someone's like, yeah, I did ONS solo. And you're like. OK. No one brought that up. OK. Like that's a, that's a bit much, but I I don't I don't think it's anything worse. Okay, you can get good RNG for ONS if you take the time and have good damage. Yeah, it is doable. So wait, the stairs behind them is that like part of a strategy or something? I don't know. I'm just gonna practice it the next time we're on, which is honestly probably gonna be tomorrow night. I mean, I'm probably going to be on at the exact same time. I've been getting on for everyone that's out there right now. I'm um, about 5 p.m. Eastern and then, you know, playing until about 8 o'clock so that that way I can still spend some time with my girlfriend. Um, and she's going to be working pretty much nights this week. So uh, I might be I might be on pretty consistently around that time, like 5 to 8, 5 to 8, you know, something like that. But um, we're going to go find someone fantastic out there to raid so I can spend some time with her. I'm not real good at video games. I would say that I'm I'm decent at a range of video games, but I'm not fantastic at a lot of them, if that makes sense to you. Like, I'm, I'm, I'm a good player, and I've played a wide range of games, but I'm not, I'm not amazing. I'm not, I'm probably not Shroud, you know. Um, I used to play professionally. I played Halo 1 professionally. Glad I caught you. Have a great night. Wizard of Raz, hopefully we get the opportunity to chat more. I'd love to hear about your adventure so far in your first year of Dark Souls. I think that that's going to be exciting to hear about. Um, we're going to find someone fantastic out there. We're going to blow them up with the raid. Hopefully you guys have a great rest of your night. And I hope the, the start of the week has treated you well. Indeed, indeed. Um, let's see who we've got online right now. Some world-class Apex players. We got some people playing Resident Evil Village. I don't know. Do you guys? Do you guys have anyone that you're? Uh, sorry, any categories that you're invested in, interested in, nerd? You and your cats. I love my cats. Let me tell you. Oh, man, I have some stories. Well, I'm eager to hear about it. I'm eager to hear about it. Um, actually, you know what? We're going to raid that bitch. We're going to raid. We're going to raid one of our friends. She was in here earlier, and she's been so incredibly supportive to uh, to everything that's been going on with, you know, our our wonderful friendship between her and my uh, girlfriend. She's great people. Um, we're going to stop by and, and throw her some love. Hopefully you guys have a great night. Stay safe. Stay blessed. Stay fantastic. And we will catch you all tomorrow. Sammy, I'm sorry. We love you. I'll shoot you a text. Guys, stay awesome. Peace.